Well, it may feel like spring now, but some businesses are still feeling the wrath of January's cold snap. A local Coeur d'Alene Wellness Center that suffered a complete loss in those frigid temperatures is just now starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel. This is what Heat Praxia staff walked into after the pipes above them burst. Their entire sauna studio left in ruins. Marissa Rio gives us an update on Heat Praxia's road to recovery. Driving through downtown Coeur d'Alene looks a bit different now. The street is down one local business. The water damage Heat Praxia suffered during January's freeze was so extensive, they needed to relocate if they wanted to continue their dream. We've had a struggle with having our, our insurance claim has still not processed, so uh, that's probably been the, the largest struggle amongst all of them in the last two months because it's kind of frozen our path forward. But after two months, Heat Praxia has found its silver lining, recently signing a lease to a new location that's four and a half times bigger than its last. As Heather gives us a tour of the inside, she shares the company's whirlwind of emotions. Stress and, you know, maybe slightly scary and it's just, is a huge leap, um, but I would say more than anything else, just excitement for the future. And the excitement to serve the community again is evident with holes in the wall where staff literally kicked off the start of their rebuild. There will be nine saunas here, one large cold plunge, and a classroom to do breath work in. Right now I'm standing outside of Heat Praxia's communal sauna, and let me tell you, the views here are beautiful. You have the lake right over here, and then Tubbs Hill is right behind me. Heat Praxia says they hope to now utilize this outdoor space. Now being lakefront and having Tubbs Hill okay. so close, Heather says they hope to give discounts to those who are out hiking. We want to incentivize getting out there, being active, being in nature. Heat Praxia hopes to have its grand reopening at the beginning of September. Back to school, uh, all the parents get their kids off and come to Heat Praxia and <laughs> decompress from from how much work all of that is. For more information on ways you can support Hepraxia, visit our website at kxly.com. Reporting in Coeur d'Alene, Marissa Rio, 4 News Now.